dit Pastor Chris said something that is you know so striking one day Pastor Chris a dit quelque chose qui m'a He said I've done that many times Et il a fait cela plusieurs said, fois I'm saying this because I know who I am Greetings my family how are you doing welcome again to Direct TV bringing to you the truth Welcome guys to this special episode of my video today and right in today's video guys I'm here with um two men of God I personal Apostle Femi Lazarus um, Apostle Femi Lazarus and also a man of God that is going to be inspiring you today all right He's going to be talking about the man of God Reverend Dr Chris first of all I'm going to be coming with him all right Pastor Chris did share this testimony some time ago um um during your love all right but um you know those content like that couldn't be you know pre- 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 um brought out but this man of god here all right actually you know re-echoed and shared the testimony which i would like you to listen to an inspiring testimony of how pastor chris actually transformed and one thousand dollars to a hundred thousand dollars guys so before we dive into the video uh, for those of you coming new to my channel kindly do subscribe button subscribe and then if you ever like the video up to this point please hit the like button like to this video guys watch this i'll be right back you, you don't understand what I'm talking about. There is, a, there is a level that you can enter in the spirit. Pastor Chris said something that is, you know, so striking one day. He said, I've done that many times. He said, I'm saying this because I know who I am. He said, I've called people. I've called people. I've called people gave them money. And said to them, count it. Et il a dit comptez maintenant. And they went, you know, one dollar, two dollar, two dollars, until they get to a thousand dollars. He said, Are you sure? They said yes. They counted like that. Then they, they counted the money, and then it was a thousand. He said, Are you sure? This? They said yes. Qu'ils ont compté une deuxième fois. Est-ce que vous êtes sûr qu'il y avait mille dollars? And he said okay. Il a dit okay. And he uttered some tongues. Et il a commencé à parler en langue. And said to them, Go and count the same money. Il dit maintenant, allez recompter l'argent. Now they were counting the second time. He said when they got to a thousand dollars, they kept looking at him like this. Why? Because they kept continuing. It was not stopping until they reached twenty thousand dollars. And he stopped and said, count the money again. Il a dit arrêtez mais recomptez encore. They went une fois again until they reached 20,000. Now they are shaking. Et là ils ont continué à compter jusqu'à arriver à 20,000. And he said okay. Spoke some tongues. Il dit parlez en langue maintenant. And said count the money again. Et maintenant recomptez l'argent. And, and, and it moved to 100,000 dollars. Et l'argent a multiplié. Ra canto ske prante villa caruske. Hey! That lady, take it. All right, my family, there you have it with that man of God. Were you inspired? Did you learn something? All right. A very inspiring testimony indeed. Now, guys, um, I want you to listen to the man of God, Apostle Femi Lazarus. Um, he's going to be addressing something that I think each and every one of us um, need to really listen. All right. And it's about the bitterness in the heart of pastors, members, all right, different people. But this will actually inspire you. And will cause many of you to you know come back to respecting men of god guys so um let's watch this guys i'll be right back don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe let me tell you something you will never find anyone that came from a good home drag anybody on social media quote me anyway there's pain look at the weight of words a young boy is calling Adeboy a fool look at the weight where did you learn it what happened to your childhood what happened to your heart words are heavy when it's not heavy in your heart something is wrong with the heart it's recycling of pain it's recycling and it's everywhere why will you just throw these words at people it's the cycle the lecturer is from a bad home, was also trained by a lecturer who was a sadist, will also cycle the same thing in the students who become lecturers, and the system never ends. We must not have people in the body of Christ who are bitter, who are angry, who are pained, who are looking for loopholes in messages to drag people. When they are blessed, they don't talk. When they see loopholes, they drag. That is not the move of the spirit. God is not raised and hand me of injurious young people who look at their father's age mate and call him a fool. For doctrinal imbalance, that is not the move of the spirit. One generation will serve him and will command him to another. That's the spirit. We carry this grace to our homes, to our schools, to everywhere around us. That we don't just stand for the truth, we stand for healing of the body of Christ. Fathers are bitter, young people are bitter, members are bitter, pastors are bitter. Hey! 
And the devil is having his field there amongst us. But an end has come to that. 